And now on CBS 2 at 5, an investigation is underway into a deadly collision involving a police car. Hello, I'm Lisa Siegel. And I'm Juan Fernandez. A man was killed today when his motor scooter collided with a Santa Monica patrol car. An officer was injured. It happened at the intersection of 4th Street and Pico Boulevard near Santa Monica High School. CBS 2's Art Barron spoke to a witness at the scene. Well, the intersection opened about 45 minutes ago. The CHP has been investigating a fatal accident between a motor scooter and a Santa Monica police patrol car. And then all of a sudden, all you heard was crash, and yeah. we looked over and saw debris all over the place. A mangled scooter with bits and pieces of debris show where a collision between a Santa Monica police patrol unit and scooter occurred this morning, shortly after 730. Lucas Gomez was right up the street when it happened. We walked all the way down there and saw that the guy was on the floor. Okay. So. Was it moving at all? No movement at all. And unfortunately, the uh, gentleman riding the motor scooter passed away. It happened at the intersection of 4th and Pico, which was closed off to traffic for most of the day. The Santa Monica police officer was taken to Santa Monica UCLA Medical Center, treated for moderate injuries. There was no lights on that on that particular uh, So it seems to me that this, this particular officer was not on a particular call at the I, time. Not at all. At this point, everything is still under investigation. The CHP says the scooter was traveling eastbound on Pico, and the officer was headed north on 4th Street. It's not known who had the right of way. Kind of walked up on it, and it looks like the entire uh, driver's side door of the officer's vehicle is completely bashed in. There is visible damage to the driver's side of the police car. This gas station has security cameras. The video shows the police car quickly pulling over after it was hit broadside, but the video didn't capture the accident. One local resident says he T-boned a car at the same intersection 12 years ago. This doesn't surprise me because there's been a lot of fender benders and accidents at this intersection over the years. The police officer has been released from the hospital, and the CHP says if you know anything about this accident or may have seen something, to please give them a call. That's the very latest in Santa Monica Art Baron. CBS 2 News.